I have missed this job a lot, so, so much. The number one thing I missed about this job, and it is because I'm a narcissist, <laughs> is the clapping, the big rounds of applause. the clapping so so much because remember this is my job this is what I do for a living minimum twice a show I get a massive round of applause coming on stage leaving stage sometimes in the middle of a show just like that completely organically Three, four, five big rounds of applause every single show, four, five nights a week for 10 years. You are not the same person at the end of that. <laughs> that fundamentally rewires your brain. I'm a clapaholic. I'm a clap junkie. I can't function without claps. I need claps to let me know that I'm a worthy human being. And then all of a sudden, last March, without warning, overnight, boom, government switched my tap off. No more claps of Tez Elias. I became one of you, love. <laughs> Piece of shit. You know, just... <laughs> you know, most people doing their day to day job, they don't get claps in it. You just do your job, no one's applauding you. When you walk into the office, the elevator opens, no one's going, Yeah, you come to work. It doesn't happen. I come off there, you're like, Yeah, he's here. You know, I. It doesn't happen for you lot like that. And it was difficult for me adjusting back to civilian life. So it was tricky. And I thought, you know, where, where do you substitute clubs from? Where do you get clubs from in real life? And it was tricky for me because I'm a single guy. So I didn't have anyone's cheeks to clap at home. Um, <laughs> unnecessary that. Um, I didn't say come with your family, did I? You did that on your own. Um, I didn't say come with your mum, so. So it was like two, three weeks into the pandemic. And I'm really getting withdrawal symptoms. Like, I need some claps just to carry me through the next couple of weeks. I'm like, where do I get these claps from? And then I had an amazing idea. In my room, I saw the washing basket. And I picked it up. And I, did, I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> I thought it was stuck to the... But I picked, you know, like Captain America at the end of Endgame and he picks up Thor's hammer. I was like, huh? I'm worthy. No, I thought it was, I don't know how my mum used to do it, but like I just, I picked it up and I went, oh my days, what a change. So I took it all the way downstairs and I went to the kitchen and I put it in front of the washing machine. I didn't load it, I'm not a prick. But I put it in front of the, I put it in front of the washing machine and I turned to my mum standing in the kitchen and I went, mama, ta-da, ta-da. Nothing, absolutely nothing from my mum. Not even a sarcastic, slow, you know that like, slow hand clap that means sarcasm. Not even one of them. I'd have even taken that. That's methadone. I would have taken one of them. Not even that. I was like, but mum, mum, look, I separated the colours and the whites just like London does. Nothing, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely nothing from my mum. You know what you have to do in this country last year to get a round of applause? Save a life. <laughs> is that our country now? Is that, is that a civilized country, that? Is that you lot now? Let me open my cheek. Turn itself. Is that, is that you now? Yeah. Is that a civilized country? Yeah. Oh, look, you save a little life. Get a little clap. Oh, look, she didn't let that man die. <laughs> oh, look, she put in a drip all by herself. Man, you're a hero. <laughs> oh, look, that GP's in an over the phone consultation. Well done, mate. Well done. <laughs> Even though they call about ATM to get an appointment, very inconvenient. Well done. Well done. What was that? Sorry? Pay rise? Piss off. Spend that. Spend that. Spend that. <laughs> get your pots and pans out. Let her know you love them. <laughs> 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 Clap thieves, that's what I call them. <laughs> you know, it's not all frontline professionals, it's not all heroes that work in the NHS. They got HR department, innit? <laughs> they got pen pushers that work there. Did you differentiate where your claps went? 
when you're on the doorstep like lemmings, did you, were you like, frontline service staff only? No, you clap for all of them. You're like, oh look, the guy disciplined the Filipino nurse for complaining about racism. Well done, mate, well done. Well done. Hero hater, it's NHS hater, so it's a hero automatically. Mm. Oh look, that car park that charges everyone for seeing their dying loved ones. Well done, NHS car park, well done. 15 pound for 10 minutes, well done. Hero car park. It's a NHS car park, so it has to be a hero. Mm. <laughs> Do we have any in? <laughs> NHS stuff, not car parks. Very, put your hands up, my NHS lot, where are you? You're always in. Well, I've got one there, one right here as well. Right. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> this is my claps! <laughs> Guys, we're gonna play a little game of top trumps and. And whoever had the shittest NHS job, you will be thrown out of the show. <laughs> like roughly by the scruff of the neck, get out you fucking clap thief. Get the fuck out. Straight out of the fire exit there. Straight out of there, get the fuck out, you clap thief. <laughs> so no pressure, there's no pressure. Uh, just, you know, just enjoy yourselves. If la, la, nice and nice, what do you do for the NHS? I just training and support. You fucking clapped for that last year. <laughs> I've got a Prince 2 qualification. Fuck off. Mm, four nurses' salaries he's taking. <laughs> fucking bottom, mate. You're at the bottom. <laughs> What's up, bro? <laughs> Quick, you put your hand up 10 minutes ago, weren't you? Me! Come on, let's talk now. Yeah, hair back for them claps you stole off me last year. What was your name, Reminders? Zane. Zane, nice to meet you, Zane. Zane, what do you do for the NHS? Uh, management. management. Fuck off, no, what a prick. <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> Trying to run it, well, you fucked it, innit? <laughs> I earn those claps. <laughs> Tough, bro. Nice and loud for the people at the back. What do you do for the NHS? Um. Fuck off. <laughs> it's a halal drug dealer, innit? <laughs> uh, 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 uh. What was it? Sorry, mental health support worker? Yeah. Fuck off. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Have you tried not being sad? Fuck <laughs> off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Mm, mm. Turn that frown upside down. Fuck off. He's a little sticker. There you go. Fuck off. <laughs>